Hello and welcome to my 11th Python tutorial. So in this tutorial we'll be learning um, about multiple variable assignment. And so multiple variable assignment is uh, taking two variables <coughs> and assigning it to two expressions. So I want to um, go over this uh, quick little problem with you. Alrighty, so x is equal to 5, and y is equal to 10. Now we want to switch the values. We want y to now be 5, and we want x to now be 10. How do we do that? If we do x is equal to y, and y is equal to x, then everything's just going to be 10 say x, we say y, they're both 10. And the reason this happens is because we're assigning, sorry, we're assigning the variable to an expression, which, um, these are the expressions. So we're assigning this to 10, and now we're getting the variable, and we're saying this is equal to 10 also. That's not going to work out. Uh, and an, another way to do this is x is equal to 5 and y is equal to 10. And we have ah, then we need a third variable. So z is equal to 0 or 5, let's say. Now we can say uh, x is equal to y, so x is now 10, and y is equal to z. Now we print x, x is now 10, and it was 5 before, and y is now 5. So we've successfully uh, switched the values of these two variables but there's a way easier way to do this. That's called multiple variable assignment, which this lesson is about. X is equal to 5, and Y is equal to 10. And now, with multiple variable assignment, we assign things simultaneously uh, by s separating them by commas. X comma Y is equal to y comma x. So simultaneously, x is going to be equal to y and y is going to be equal to x. Let me try this out. Now x should be 10 and y is 5, just like magic. That's awesome. We can also um, do that with inputting numbers. So, um, 1 comma 2 is equal to eval input uh, enter two numbers. Uh, if this was a real program, I would tell them to uh, separate it by a comma, but I don't want to do that. And we will put one comma two. Now one, ooh, that came out weird. One is one and two is two. See how that worked? Um, sure, you can find something creative to do with that. That's not just switching values or doing this. It makes uh, writing programs much shorter and uh, much more useful. Uh, instead of writing five lines, we just write uh, three. Saves us a lot of time. Multiple variable assignment is awesome. That pretty much wraps it up for uh, this uh, lesson. Uh, I will see you next time.